take a look at the tail of the tape. As you can see there, Carol slightly older, Blood taller, Carol also more experienced. Olivia Lord in the blue corner, Alessandro Carol in the red. And Carol fighting. Oh, two guys fighting. South Paws going at it. Swinging and banging early. So please understand that this is a professional bout, so it's going to be a five minute round. No time to lose by any of these two, and uh, Carol wants to snipe very early. I think it's the reason why it's your favorite weight class because these guys uh, usually are very explosive and they can go very fast for very long. Yep, they're like the Energizer Bunny. They just keep going and going and going. Oh, didn't feel it. I mean, we saw Lode unloading with the left hand and uh, Carol just took it like a champ, barely moved. Was Lord unloading? Yeah, that's what I said, yeah. Lode unloading. Yeah. Thank I like you. That. Thank I you like for it. noticing. Oh, 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 connects with a right hand. Does does Lord? Honestly, I feel like both guys have connected with some solid shots. And the attack now. So Carol has actually trained uh, with Bulgarian top team, which is actually a very strong MMA team in Europe, specifically for wrestling. And I think we're seeing the fruits of that labor here. So in the half guard now is Carol, back to full guard. So far no strike attempts. There we go. Just had to ask. Asking you shall receive, right? I think he's being instructed by just pushing the head of, uh, of his opponent. Need to create some distance, just push with the left hand and then just pound with the right hand. Alexander uh, Carroll still in control, finding his way left and right now, and again with the pressure. He might almost was able to step over right into full mount. Couldn't quite get the extension that he needed with his legs, but he's doing a good job at following the hips of, of Lord, preventing any kind of escape. Still stuck to him very close. Just uh, improving his position step by step, inch by inch, just trying to free it. That body part. Now there is much more of a leg and tangle than before that. The half guard was somewhat open. So this is definitely better defensively for Lord, but yeah, he's gonna need to scramble out of this because you still at the end of the day. Yeah. There you go, that's what you want. Yeah, I was just about to say, fighters have gotten so much better at striking from half guard. Ooh, nasty up kick. Once again, he took it as if nothing happened. That's crazy. Yeah. Great chins on both of these guys. I don't know if you heard, but uh, the corner of Lode said, uh, don't worry, he's not dangerous on the ground. So they don't seem to be fearing the uh, submission tactic of uh, Carroll. They should be fearing those nasty knees to the, to the spine. Gotta hurt. Okay, maybe he's not the uh, submission specialist you thought he was, but. Oh, I mean, wrestling, not so much yeah. grappling. And I think we're seeing that top heavy wrestling uh, here. Uh, looking to snipe with those punches, moving the legs of his opponent to the side, and this then going to the attack. Great job by Caron. Thirty seconds now. In this first round. 
And it looks like Paul Dena in the audience as well. Just behind. I also saw Ibra TV earlier, so not sitting uh, not far. Great top control from Whoa. Big Hammer Fists. Things are heating up always in the last 10 seconds. It's always, you know, when you hear the 10 second buzzer, usually, yeah. <laughs> It's a good, uh... Well, that's when you kind of know that you can get a little bit reckless. It's probably not the best uh, uh, opportunity to start setting up a complicated submission, but that's where you might as well just land as much offense as possible. Because even if it doesn't win you the round, it's at least going to give, it's going to chip away at our power bar, you know? It's also being super exciting for the crowd, so you can't complain about that. Yeah. It's a recipe for success any way you slice it. So I thought that they were pretty even on the feet. Both fighters had their moments, but as soon as Carol took it to the ground, it was basically he. Was, it was a one-sided pounding, and he was swinging the hammer. Now you're right. Maybe uh, Lode doesn't is not fearing the uh, submission uh, tactic of Carol, but he should be fearing the. Just the domination, complete domination on the ground. I mean, he got, he's got to do something to get back on his feet, just turn him back to a, into a stand-up war, or else uh, it's going to be the same thing time and time again. So, these two fi fighters, uh, magical left hand. Nice to see this mirror effect between the two. And for southpaw, sometimes it can be a little bit tricky fighting another southpaw. Usually they do tend to fight orthodox fighters, and that builds a certain kind of mold. The, oh, front <laughs> kick up the middle there towards the face. I don't think it landed properly, but... Got to be careful with the, uh, the low blow. Yeah, it almost looked like a punch straight to the pills. <laughs> That's what I saw, too. <laughs> nice. Jabbing your way to the top. Ooh. Nice evasion there by Lord. Yeah, but it was pretty obvious he was just trying to set up that punch to the face to, uh, to just lower his body and, uh, and get the takedown. It was easy to read. Even oh, that one was not as easy. But once again, Lode takes it. Nothing. You know, he takes a high kick and match continues. Yeah, I'm very, very impressed with his resilience. And uh -oh. Uh oh, with left hand. Seem to be bothered. His right eye blinked uh, 25 times in a row. Oh, great time here from Carol. I don't think he really liked the way the striking changes were going, and he gets the takedown. Working on locking up the Dagestani handcuff there, but instead uses it to take the back. He's in that three quarter back mount, kind of. A great position for ground and pound here. Uses it to take the back now. He's got one hook, one hook in. in. He's taking his time. He's got 240 and he's plenty of time to get the rear naked choke. He's going to get the submission. This That's time it's it. for real. This time it's over. We got to get the win for Khan. And this is set, ladies and gentlemen. Second round submission for Alexander Carol. Welcome back to the win column. You said it, Sebastian. I mean, he. Uh, he was a little bit tangled on the ground and took his time to get the, the hook in and step by step wormed his way to the submission. Then just got one opportunity to uh, cinch in the rear naked choke and it was a done deal very quickly. Grappling, don't be afraid about a submission. And in the end, what happened? Hey, he should have been afraid for us, hey. uh, grappling and submissions. <laughs> I mean, maybe they were just trying to gas him up a little bit. Wow, look at that. Great transition from ground and pound to ground. Mesdames et messieurs, le vainqueur de ce combat, le 